Hello, welcome to Moons Plaza. My name is Emin. Today I am your host. We are doing another booster box fusion strike opening. 36 packs. We just uh, ripped off the seal and we are excited to hop into it. But first, since that is our second booster box we are going to be opening, I'm going to be going over the first pulls we got from our very first booster box ever opening. And I'm excited to share the rarest card you could get out of Fusion Strike, um, and we pulled it. So I am very happy to learn that afterwards, this is an incredible card, um, and one of the hardest cards to pull, so very cool. We went on to pull an Italian VMAX, a very good card I learned later on that this guy smashes in the online TCG. We got our first Power Tablet Gold, freaking amazing. A Mew V, awesome. A Sandaconda V, a Pikachu V, a Shauna Trainer Full Art, very cute. A Cinderace V, and a Serena V. All in our first booster box opening. I honestly don't think you can get a better booster box opening than that. We got the Gengar V Max, a Pikachu, and a very powerful card, the Inteleon. And when I say Italian V Max and Italian V Dex smash in the TCG, they absolutely crush it. We then went to open up some booster packs, some individual booster packs. And the first booster packs that we opened, we ended up pulling a Mew V. Later on, we got the Mew V out of the booster box, as Ford mentioned. Um, but nonetheless, this is our first duplicate V and one of the most uh, valuable V's you could get as a duplicate. So we are very lucky so far with Fusion Strike. Uh, we did end up pulling a, Ho a Hoopa V Special Art out of an individual pack. So that's cool. We pulled a Crab Abominable V Special Art. Very cool. Again, our Mu V. A Bolton V. Very cool. This guy looks freaking awesome. A Rillaboom V. And a Berloom V. So there you have it. Our adventure into Pokemon Fusion Strike has been very fortunate. And with all these, it just adds to the momentum of wanting to pull more. So that's what we're going to be doing today. We're going to be unboxing our second fusion strike booster box 36 packs we're gonna power through them and try to do this in one shot but first we have a small small gift that was included with a purchase of some Gengar V's I ended up looking for uh, just because I wanted to play my Gengar V max so I went on and found a great deal for three Gengar V's just pretty awesome the hollowing on this looks amazing and it was included inside the purchase a free gift that I had no idea of. so I haven't actually seen what this is yet and I thought I'd save it and uh, make it a very special reaction for uh, this booster box opening uh, so here we go we got our three Gengar V's and the free gift um, also with the Gengar V's he included the Mew Elite uh, trainer box sleeves which is pretty nice uh, pretty awesome so thank you to that person. And uh, here is the free gift. Ooh, we got a Rillaboom Rapid Strike. Look at that. Very cool. So I don't know any of the newer Pokemon because I haven't played Sword and Shield, but Rillaboom seems pretty cool. Let me know down below if this is a good card. So there you have it. Uh, with my three Gengar Vs, I got a free Rillaboom um, Rapid Strike. Very cool. Uh, very cool. Powerful attack. I'm going to have to read that later to see if it's uh, an addition to a deck we could build. So, we are beginning. Fusion Strike. Sword and Shield. Booster Box. Numero 2. Uh, team left versus team right. We are going to continue the tradition. Uh, we aren't going to mix any of the packs. We're just going to go straight on into it. So, if you are team left or team right, please send your luck. Um, I will be congratulating you at the end. And we are going to start off with Team Left. Um, so let us begin right into it. 
and I am so excited that uh, we are actually opening up another booster box uh, from Fusion Strike just because it's so much fun and um, we've uh, had very good luck with uh, Fusion Strike so far. Water Energy, very cool. A Lanoon Galarian, very nice. A Stantler, a Gliscor, a Muna, a Meowth, a Meryl, very cool, we needed one to complete the set. A Helioptile, very cool. A Wooloo, a Victini Reverse, would you look at that? Very awesome. We did get the regular version non hollow so the uh, um, uh, the uh, reverse holo, very cool. And we got a rare Electrode, very cool, our first Electrode out of Fusion Strike set. Very awesome. We're going to put that, good pull for team left so far. I'm going to quickly sleeve this Victini and this Electrode, as we do want to preserve uh, them very freshly on uh, just because uh, I'm not sure what I want to do with all these cards yet uh, cards that I don't need that could be built into a deck for somebody else I might just give away um, I hope you guys are liking the music as well um, so there we go team left starting off strong with the victory I'm gonna put that up, up in the front team right ooh Gengar pack uh, art very cool here we go I think I'm getting a little bit faster at this. I'm not sure. I did see a couple of other um, YouTubers and watch their content. Um, I always forget one of their names, but she's very awesome. Uh, she, uh, we're gonna put that off to the side. Uh, I keep forgetting her name, but she, uh, I have to actually look into it. So we got a cross Seaver. A semi sage and their pack openings are insane they open them like nothing i i don't know how they do them um but we'll learn we'll get there uh, two booster po uh, packets in Ooh, more pico uh reverse hollow very awesome and an absol very cool very awesome card i want to build a deck with absol um just because he has a cool uh attack drag off you switch one of your opponent's bench Pokemon uh, with their active, and then the switched out Pokemon takes 30 damage. That's 30 damage counters. That's pretty good. Uh, so if you're going against a VMAX, pop it off. Uh, switch with something that has a high retreat cost, and uh, keep pounding away with Absol. So very cool. Uh, very good pull for team right. We're going to continue team left. Send some luck. We do want some Vs. We do want a God Pack. I don't know if you could get a God Pack from a booster box. Um, we do want um, some more Golds. Um, here we go. Oh, no, 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 no. We gotta flip it around. Do the whole one, two, three, four. Flip it over. There we go. Dark Energy. A Halucha, a Lapras, a Schoolboy, a Dupider, a Meowth, an Onyx, a Chutul, a Shroomish, a Reverse Jinx. If you've seen my other videos, you know how I feel about this cursed card. But still, oh my god, that's gonna be a sleeve. And a Feraligator! We now have completed the set of the uh, Alligators. Totodile, Krokna, and for Alligator. That's an amazing pull from Team Left? Yes, from Team Left. Good job, wow, look at that. Just look at the hollow. It really makes for Alligator pop out, doesn't it? I'm gonna have to read this to see if it's a definite um, card we could include inside a deck. But that is awesome. I haven't seen a for Alligator and a Totodile build in a very long time. Um, I'm very excited to see uh, what we can make. So here we go. Team right got the amazing Mew pack cart, uh, art. Sorry, I was thinking a card and then 
art came out, and then I was thinking of a new card and what to say about it. And my brain sometimes goes too fast for my mouth and my actions. We're gonna put that out to the side. One, two, three, four. I apologize I'm not showing the codes. Oh, look at that. Our Pokemon card came upside down inside a pack. So this must be a good pack. I really do think that Team Wright has a pretty good pack here. So a spongy glove, a mudkip, very awesome, a sand true, a kufant, a impidimp, a shroom, a graveler reverse. Very nice. I think we've completed the reverse set of the rock type Geodude uh, evolution line. And what did I tell you? Our second duplicate, Serena V, Team Right, with the first V pull. That's a win. That is an incredible win. So now we have one for a collection and one to consider for play, as well as maybe consider giving it away to a lucky viewer. Uh, might just make a pack out of all these and just give them all away. So very cool. Very awesome pull from Team Right. We're gonna sleeve this Graveler reverse. Cool, very, very awesome. Team Right answers right back with a V pool. So there we go. Team Right with an obvious lead on Team Left from the booster box. And it seems to me that Team Right, the right side of booster boxes, and I don't know if Pokemon wants me to say this. Whew, that is some powerful music, isn't it? Let me go ahead and just go down one volume level. There we go. So I don't know if Pokemon wants me to expose this little bit of secret, if it even is a secret, but it does seem the right side of a booster box is the most fortunate. Uh, we got a Leaf Energy, a Frost Moth, a Simi Seer, a Farewell Bell, a Clamp Pearl, a more Pico, a Skarmory, a Shalmet, very cool art. We got a Plusle, a Reverse Landorus. Oh my goodness, that's incredible. And Team Left answers Team Right with its very own Intellion V. Oh my gosh, this is a good pull. Why? Because earlier we did show we got Intellion V Max. So now we can play an Italian V deck. Um, as for mentioned, uh, Italian decks right now in online TCG absolutely crush it. They're very powerful. Um, they have very good abilities. Uh, so, wow. Team right, I'm gonna give you, uh, I'm sorry, team left. I'm gonna go ahead and give you a solid lead over Team Right, and I think I spoke too soon. Um, maybe, maybe it switches. Maybe left side of uh, a pack of booster boxes, the luckiest. So let's continue on and find out, shall we? Here we go. God, I can't believe that Italian V pool. Amazing. I'm super excited. I really want to do actually do build an Italian deck uh, just because they seem like so much fun. And they seem very powerful. So here we go. We're gonna put that out to the side. One, two, three, four. Take that. Here we go. Metal energy, very nice. Skaters Park. A Lopany. He's Marsh Tomp. I don't think we got a Swampert yet, so we are hoping for if there is even a Swampert. We got a Groomy, very cool. A Aracuda, a Chansey Reverse. Chanseys do seem like a common uh, card to pull in this, but still, nonetheless, Chanseys are very awesome to pull. And Team Riot gets a Blizzy, are you kidding me? Do we just get the, what is it called, a Rewind? as the uh, rare, the super rare, and the chancy, um, and the reverse, I mean. Wow, 
That's a lucky pack. That is actually, that's, I don't think that's happened to me where I had the evolution line back to back and one being the uh, reverse. So that's very cool. I'm gonna give a small little boost to Team Right for that because, well, that was pretty awesome. There we have it. So we're gonna go ahead and put this off to the side. There we go. Um, team left still in a heavy, hefty lead with team right slowly behind. But don't estimate, don't underestimate team right. Uh, team right has had some incredible things happen and some incredible calls uh, and answers to uh, pulls from team left. So here we go for Lightning Energy, Fey Lynx, very cool, uh, a Simi Sage, a Dancer, very awesome, a Slugma, I think this might be our first Slugma out of the set, so very cool, a Skitty, another Fey Lynx, very cool, two Fey Lynx in one pack, that's very good luck, a Volibi, a Seawaddle Reverse, very cool. And a Yivatel non hollow. So even though this is a non hollow, still very co uh, cool card to pull. Uh, you could actually see some great detail in the non hollows. So always take a second look at your non hollows uh, because you might miss some, um, some shine or some sparkle. I'm sorry, that, that should be referred to in, for the holographics. What I mean by shine and sparkle is by the extra gleam of a card, the extra, not gleam, uh, the extra details in some of the card art that most kind of brush over, um, which is what I most appreciate from Pokemon cards. Um, coloring, details, the type of uh, art used, whether it be something like this that's a little obscure, uh, a little abstract, something very uh, new to the anime style, like this Meowth, uh, something very uh, watercolor or texture, like um, paints or pencils, or even this, something like very basic shapes, very cool. I appreciate from Pokemon cards. Uh, we got a Pan Pour Reverse and a Swamper. Holographic, look at that. So this is our second Swampert, I believe. So we might actually look into making a Swampert deck. And look at that. The Holographic really just makes it stand out. Wow. Very cool. That's a sleeve. So although not a V, a very cool card to pull nonetheless. Um, so there we have it. Team... I think that was team right 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 team right okay so team left still on the lead let's see if they can continue to pull ahead Ooh, and this pack feels tight like like everything's really sealed in there almost feels like there's more than there should be of cards inside this pack so let's see we got our first mantine i think out of the pack that was a genesect uh pack cover art so very cool this definitely does feel like there is more cards in this pack two three four fire energy that's a good sign an extra drill very powerful a double spongy gloves a mantine a grubbin a rotom a smeargle so I wasn't counting if this is more cards than should have been in the pack. Let me know down below. A Muna Reverse. Very cool. Very cool. Very, very awesome. And a Gudra. Very nice. Very special rare indeed. So that's going to be a small sleeve. So we do have the set complete for the Gudra. And we do have the set complete for the Muna and uh, the Evolution. Um, I think we need the reverse of Muna and we would complete the reverse hollows of that. So very cool. Very awesome uh, pack from Team Left.
team right gets a Gengar V cover art. And oh no, I think we got to reset our tones here. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Okay, here we go. Opening that. Ooh, uh, booster boxes do take quite a bit of time, so we're going to one, two, three, four. I already forgot if this is team left or team right. Uh, this should be team right. Crocona and Elsa Sparkle, a Beware, a Drill Burn, a Shinx, a Buneary, a Grubbin, a Basculin, very cool, a Ninetales Reverse, very beautiful, and a Verizian, super rare, very cool. Bail out, uh, put up to two Pokemon, or discard into your hand, and Solar Beam, 90 damage. Very good card. If I could get this one reverse, or actual Hollow, that would make this card very sweet to have. Um, so there we have it. Oh, you gotta put Swampert over here, because that's a small pull win for team right. Team left, I think. Oh no, I might have gave an, an extra pack opening to team left. So I think we should make this part one of two. One, two, three, four. We will see. Actually, we're just going to continue on, and then I can edit it and post. Um, so here we go. A Darmanitan, a Shelter, a Voltorb. We can match with that Electrode we pulled earlier. A Kufance, a Gligar. Very cool. A Dunsparce Reverse, very cool. That's a sleeve, and a Zero Aura, super rare, very cool. Let's go ahead and sleeve this Dunsparce. That is, it is our first Reverse Holo. Um, I have a good, uh, a good fondness of Reverse Holos, just because um, some cards do deserve that shine. And Pokemon has been very good so far with um, giving those chances to those Pokemon that do deserve uh, a good shine. Uh, do you guys agree? I, I think I think that's a healthy way to look at it. So team right, pack. There we go. Put that out to the side. One, two, three, four. Put that under. A Leaf Energy, very cool. A Semi Pour. A butt catcher, a wiggly, a more peco, a skarmory, a shellman, a plusel, a uh oh, a muna, a elisa, a elisa sparkle reverse holographic, very cool. This is definitely a bling card to add to a deck, um, to, to make your deck look very awesome, um, and. A Cloister, Rapid Strike, very cool. A Cloister, in my opinion, I do want to run more in the online TCG just because it has the shell armor, which means it takes less uh, damage, as you can see right there. It takes 30 less damage, and then Aqua Split um, does 30 damage to, uh, also does 30 damage to your Pokemon's bench, two of your Pokemon's bench. So very cool, Cloister, very awesome card. I do want to make a deck for Cloyster. Um, I think Galarian Moltres, which I pulled out of a pack on the online TCG, um, has the same effect, I'm thinking, or no, is that Reshiram Celebrations? Uh, that has damage done to bench Pokemon. Uh, Inteleon does that, I know that much, which is why I want to build the deck. His second gunner ability in the VMAX state. Very cool. Okay, team left. Let's see if we can continue on. We're at the 24 minute mark. My god. 24 minutes have passed. Time flies when you're having fun. Metal energy. Cool. Sydney. Cross switcher. A croconaut. I like saying croconaut's name. Uh, Skarmory, a Jinx, a Jinx, 
a Barascuda. Very cool. Reverse. I think we have the reverse set now. So very cool. And a Landorus actual hollow. Very cool. So we have the reverse and the holographic. That's a cool complete set right there. I think we have the non hollow too. I'm not sure. Uh, let's double check on that. A very cool pool. That is a small uh, win for Team Right. Just because we got the Brass Scooter and the Landorus. Very awesome. So we're going to put Landorus on top of there. We're going to move the other cards. We're going to continue. Team left. What can we get? I'm not sure how many packs we have left, but I think this should be the middle mark of the booster box. My god, we pulled so many cards already. Um, not a whole lot of these, which is fine. Uh, I'm not one to actually be downed by not getting super ultra omega rares. Uh, happy with what I get. Uh, Schoolgirl, Luxio, but that does not mean that I don't want those super rares. I super do. Uh, so, oh, we got double Caterpie in one pack? What the? Did that just happen? We got two of the same cards in one pack. That's very interesting. I've never seen that. So is this an error pack or is one of these errors? Are we gonna get another Caterpie? If we get a third Caterpie out of this pack, I think that would make my day. So more Pico, an Eevee, a Star U Reverse, very cool. If we could get Star Me, I don't know if Fusion Strike has Star Me because I haven't seen one yet, but if we could get a Reverse Star Me, that'd be very cool. And an Azumarill, very cool. So we have Meryl and Azumarill. I think we got Reverse Azumarill from a previous pack. So all we need is the Reverse Meryl. And this is a sleeve. Staryu is always just one of those cool Pokemon that you were very excited to see and to give a try, especially in the Game Boys, um, in my opinion. I think a vast majority would like to agree. There's so much mystery surrounded by Starmie. What is it communicating with in space? It sends signals in space as it stares into the night, right? That's one of the Pokedex entries. Correct me if I'm wrong. Okay, so that was team left. Yes, we are on team right. I want to know more. I absolutely do think Pokemon will release... Uh, versions of Staryu, if not an evolution line. They'll make something special out of Staryu, I just know it. Ooh, and you look at that, it's rude. A Delcaddy. A Dark Cry, are you serious? Are you insane? This is only a uncommon? What the? Is this an error card? This has to be an error, yeah? Dark Cutter, 90 damage. A Tynamo. A Zorua. A Shelter. Very cool. A Caterpie. We are getting the bugs today. A Reverse Galarian Obstagoon. Very cool. I think we have one. I think we have the regular hollow and a non hollow. And a Palisand non hollow. Very cool. So that's a double sleeve. Just because I don't want to go back and sleeve them later on. So I'm doing this while. I'm actually going to talk about a little bit of Pokemon lore surrounding Palisand. Rumor has it that Palisand once... I'm just kidding, I don't know. I don't know much about Palisand. Other than he's on the beach in Sun and Moon, I think it is. Right? So one, two, three, four. That's gotta suck. You like vacation somewhere, like somewhere amazing like Alola region and then you get swallowed up by a palisand and you're stuck in there a rod on very cool it's like what the heck very dangerous pokemon out there a grim snarl reverse i think this is a reverse uh, the first reverse grim snarl we got so very cool that's a sleeve and a claydol non hollow very cool so this booster box in my opinion, we got the Inteleon V, which is a huge win, and a Serena V. Not much luck happening. Um, so 
So please, 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 if you're a team left or team right, send out that luck. We need it. I think we're already halfway through. We pull two Vs. If we could get a gold and a um, special art, we are hoping for a Mew V Max, a Genesect V. Um, so send send your luck, please send your luck out this way. We're gonna continue. Is that team right? This team that was that was. We're gonna continue. Team left. Hopefully my camera doesn't stop because we are on the 30 minute mark and we should probably just. Uh, make this a part two. I think that's what we're going to have to do. Because uh, I'm not sure how much space I have left. If the camera cuts out, then I have no choice but to wait. Our first Panagoro! Very cool. Ooh, who's that guy? That's pretty awesome. It grapple locked. First, first out of the pack. A digger bee. I think this is our first out of the pack too. So a lot of firsts out of this, just this pack. A Meltan, a Toxel, that's a very good pack. A Staryu, a Mawile, very cool. I use this in the online TCG, very awesome. A Halucha Reverse, and I do see a VMAX. What could it be? I'm pretty excited. So Halucha, so we'll end this uh, for part one with team left, I think it was. Gets a Cinderace V, very cool. Very awesome, would you look at that? Cinderace V, and I think this is a little different from the other Cinderace V, but pretty similar. So we're gonna take a look, we're gonna compare from our first booster box Cinderace V to our second uh, Cinderace V booster box pool. So wow, that is awesome. Cinderace V, blaze kick, 210 to the whopping butt. That is nice. So let's go ahead and see if we could very carefully. There it is. Our Cinderace V from our first box. It's a single strike with slightly different art. Um, are one of these special arts or different arts? One's 44, one's 43. So no, just right next to each other. Just one is single strike. So very cool. We got the single strike and the regular. Uh, so the regular has 210, 220 HP, the single strike. Although it does more damage with less energy, does have 10 less HP, but single strike nonetheless, you could pair up some of those single strike energies or single strike special cards. Very cool. So what do you think about that? Slightly different art, but nonetheless very cool. I wonder what the VMAX looks like. So yes. Team left, I spoke way too soon on you. You are absolutely smashing it. And team right, what what happened? What is your reasoning to Pokemon Company? You're in trouble. I just think you're in big trouble. So there you have it. That's going to be part one. I'm gonna end it here. We are going to just cut away and end up right into part two uh, after this is uploaded. So please do come back and see what kind of luck we get, what kind of uh, Vs we pull. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Um, I will see you guys next time. My name is M from Loons Plaza. Bye-bye.